Hi students, this is Sivakumar, 12th standard business mathematics and statistics, chapter number 3, exercise 3.1. Here is the question, listen all of you, using integration, find the area of the region bounded by the line 2y plus x equals 8, the x-axis and between the lines x equals 2 and x equals 4 okay solution take 2y plus x that is equal to 8 since you are given x limits find y from this equation because for x-axis, you have to apply the formula integral a to be either y dx or minus y dx. So, we need y. So, that I am retaining 2y in the left hand side. 8 plus x comes right hand side minus x. So, therefore, y equals 8 minus x by 2. Let it be. Now, we have to trace the curve. Actually, it's a straight line only. X, Y. When X equal to 0, find the value of Y. And when Y equal to 0, find the value of X. Okay. Uh, let it be number 1. I do the calculation here. I am going to substitute X equal to 0. When x equal to 0 equation 1 implies y equals 8 minus x value 0 by 2 that is equal to 8 minus 0 8 by 2 that is equal to 4 so when x equal to 0 y value 4 can replace 4 over here now substitute y equal to 0 find the value of x when y equal to 0 same equation 1 implies substitute y equal to 0 0 equals 8 minus x by 2 cross multiply 2 into 0 0 that is equal to 8 minus x which implies minus x comes left hand side plus x 8 let it be in the right hand side so x that is equal to 8 these two points to be plotted so, points to be plotted or plotting points. x equal to 0, y equal to 4 means 0, 4 and x equal to 8, y equal to 0, 8, 0. x axis y axis 0 comma 4 8 comma 0 okay i take a 4 over here 8 over here 4 in y axis 8 in x axis so this is the point 0 comma 4 you know how to plot the points 0 comma 4 lies on which axis y axis 8 comma 0 lies on x axis join both the points you will be getting a straight line equation of this line here it is that is equation number 1 write anywhere I write here y that is equal to 8 minus x by 2 ok now what are the two lines given x equals 2 and x equals 4 here 8 shall we take 2 over here can take anywhere between 0 and 8 I take 2 here 4 here draw a line This line is passing through which axis? X axis. So what's the value here? 2. That is the equation of line. X equals 2 is the equation of line. Like that. What's the equation of line? X equals 4. That is given. See that? 
x equals 2 and x equals 4. Now we have to find out the closed region. Here is the closed region, correct? The closed region, one side the given line x equals to, one side the given line x equal to 4, one side is x axis, look at that, x axis, and one side is the given straight line y equal to 4 minus x. This is a closed region. This region is completely lying above x axis. So, above x axis, you know the formula already I have given. Area or required area as a shadow region only integral a to b y dx you just mentioned the shaded region is lying above x axis a is the lower limit and b is the upper limit so in this region what's the lower value 2 and upper value is 4 2 to 4 y equation number 1 y equals 8 minus x by 2 i write 8 minus x by 2 by 2 can we write half outside the integral same only half into 8 minus x and 8 minus x by 2 are same only into dx write off as it is 8 dx you can directly integrate 8 dx write the constant 8 as it is so only dx dx integration is x you know that what you have learnt in the previous chapter minus here x x power 1 isn't it we know the formula for x power n x power n dx that is equal to x power n plus 1 divided by n plus 1 so this is x power 1 so can be x power 1 plus 1 divided by 1 plus 1 according to this formula limit 2 to 4 half 8x x squared by 2 limit 2 to 4 half right as it is now I am going to apply the upper limit replace x by 4 8 into 4 minus replace x by 4 4 squared by 2 upper limit over minus now replace x by 2 8 into 2 minus 2 squared by 2 equals half 8 fourths are 32 4 squared 16 by 2 minus 8 twos are 16 2 squared 4 by 2 2 table 2 times 2 table 8 times half 32 minus 8 minus 16 minus 2 equals half 32 minus 8 that is equal to 24 16 minus 2 that is equal to 14 equals half into 24 minus 14 is 10 divide by 2 table 5 5 ones are 5 area unit always squared units so you have to mention squared unit 5 squared units that's the problem problem number 1 is over I hope that you have understood this problem so I will be teaching problem number 2 in the next video. Thank you children.